video talking about comic book sales in North America, I always like to pull up the old pictures of new warriors. Why do I like to do this? Because I like to show all of you peak Marvel Comics designs. This, this is Yellow Flash. He is a typical right winger, a typical traditional conservative. I'll call him Tradcon for short. And this video is to show, highlight how these guys are basically feminist. They use feminist terms. You know, they believe in feminism. But they always, they don't like getting beaten up by it. So they use these stupid escape terms like SJWs. I'm going to show you something. Before we go on, this was Marvel Comics, right? He's talking about Marvel Comics, right? Here's the one of the old ones. It's what is five, six years old now. Well, female for four. The kind who just broke your jaw, pow. That's for say, and she's thinking, that's for saying feminist like it's four letter word, creep. And also, you know, for the robbing. So here's a giant neon sign where they're saying we're a bunch of, Feminist who took over Marvel. They're not SJWs. So I want you guys to realize that. So anyone who talks about SJWs, you know, it's a problem. And of course, I'm going to show you this particular thread. It's a long thread, but I'll only show a few. Whereas the guy starts off with manga, we respect freedom of creativity, comics, we don't do that here. It's, it's more cope. But uh, let me get to the heart of it. You see, I started off saying they are not SJWs. They are feminist. They are feminist, remember. And please stop hiding behind that shield term, the SJW film. If, two, if men tried to do this to hobbies, women enjoy the girls, wouldn't just lie down and take it like men do. This is true. You just admitted defeat at the hands of the femmes. You aren't worthy of hobbies because you're a man, according to you. Right. Now, that's the basic that got a, a lot of uproar. This guy, McGanu, senior manager of McDonald's, also talking to me. Also, why are you saying it's only women? Like, bro, what the fuck? You got a grudge against women or something? Because that's really misogynistic. This guy uses a feminist term. This is a guy who comes and watches yellow flashes videos and i said look there are male fans but they take their orders from the girls marvel comics sank after a bunch of young lady femmes showed up the guys at marvel were happy to please the male audience up in, until then this is a fact this is fact over feelings as these right wingers love to go on about and his response is, you sound like a misogynist, man. That's, he, he's using feminist terms again. So he has nothing to say against me, you know, the obvious history of it. The obvious history of it. So all he can say is, you don't know your place. If this is your reaction to the way things are, be ready for magnet to be the next target and go the way of comics. His response, I mean, you're putting it all the blame on women. That's misogynistic. Right. That's all this guy cares about. Right? <laughs> no, just not that this is a bit of a side. Kuchikan, ah, yes, politics. See, it's feminist politics, though. That's all that's going on. So they're always talking about this left-right business. They want to obfuscate to the left, right? <laughs> Let's say, this guy, you have yet to give any evidence back up your claims. Really? I haven't given any evidence. This is all, people can find this on the internet. They can Google it if they like. <laughs> this is why no one takes you seriously. Actually, these guys don't take me seriously because what do right wingers go on about all the time? These trad cons, personal responsibility. 
And these guys aren't here for that. Personal it, it, for them to take personal responsibility, they would have to admit that they're feminist, admit that there is, you know, a gender antagonism of women to large guys. And then you would have to protest. But what they're here for is to have this Coke channel say, that's everything, everything will be all right. Uh, they're just a group of people and there, it has nothing to do with male, female dynamics and it'll self-correct. It's a coping channel. These guys come here to cope. Let's see. Now, I want to show that my comments are getting upvotes, so there are people who are willing to back the obvious. I know that, uh, what's that expression, uh, the fallacy of popularity, but I want to point this out that the, yep, the reason that, that there are people who come to Yellow Flash who are probably subs to his and fans of his that do agree that guys should protest these things, that guys should take active measures. This is what I'm really trying to say. And of course, these guys have a problem with that. <laughs> Let's say, claim, you were the one who started the claim, you must provide evidence for it to be true, right? I, I said, don't, I don't need any for the obvious, you're just in denial, which is true because I said, why am I trying to show, I already showed evidence. So they're just denying it. Now look at Reina Rudy Dersono. I have read your comics. I'll say I respect your opinions, but they're not expect opinions. I'm expressing facts. But could you please stop forcing your beliefs onto others? We are unhappy with you because of the fact that you are forcing people to sing, see things your way. No matter how many times you try to explain to them, we're not interested. They're not interested because these guys are cowards who don't want to deal with it. And of course, I bring up Kennedy again. You know, there's Kennedy wearing the forces female t-shirt. <laughs> so what I'm saying is an opinion. I am saying the obvious truth. So what is your agenda for denying the truth? <laughs> I'm quiet, sure. I'm, sure I'm, I'm quite sure is what we're probably trying to say. She's wearing that to show female empowerment. You see this person, Raina believes in female empowerment. So she is not in any way canceling our hobbies, but she did. She ruined Star Wars so the male fans don't want to deal with it, which is the majority of the fans. So he, this is just an outright falsehood. If you were talking about the Karens on Twitter, they keep bringing up Twitter, right? But Marvel Comics wasn't, was destroyed, not because someone talk, said something on Twitter about Karen's, and this thing about Karen's, notice that Karen's is a subset of women. It's been created for, because they're saying, you know, not every woman is like this. But two, notice there's no male equivalent. Karen is basically a woman showing off her privilege. She's making uh, demands for no other reason than she's a woman. So it, it's the fact that there's no male equivalent shows you that women, there is something about the opposite sex that men lack. If they were true feminist, see, he believes in the, Reina, he may be a girl, believes in the true feminist. They would be focusing on other more realistic subjects than Pascal's on a screen. <laughs> so th th these people, they're all people who watch Yellow Flash, right? Maybe I should check. Maybe she doesn't. Maybe she just checked, looked at this thread, though. I got to admit, and maybe she just saw some real pushback and said, I got to do something. So I even asked herself, can you destroy Star Wars on purpose? And you believe in female empowerment when women have more rights than men? You believe in true feminist? Yeah, it's true. Right wingers are just another form of feminism. The guy who said this was 100% on point. That's true. So this is what I'm showing to you guys. And I'm going to show this person this pick. And it doesn't matter. It won't matter to these people. Because in the end, 
they're all the same. They're all the same. And in a way, I'd have to say to you that popularity does say some, say something, right? Because if you look at, sorry for taking the long way around, Yellow Flash has over a quarter of a million subs. This has almost that much in views. His guys come here to cope. They come up here and pretend that things are going to self-correct. They use false labels to protect themselves. Because this is the other thing. If these guys, like again, if I didn't say it already, if they started active, you know, doing Activision, Activision, activism to actually protest, they know the girls would dump them. Even women who are non-feminist would dump these guys because guys fighting for the rights signal to women that they're not going to be servants and women select for servitude. So that's another reason. So they don't, actually don't have anything against feminism. They just want feminists to be good to them. Please be nice to me. <laughs> oh my God. Anyway, this is, this is all I need to say about this. And it just goes to show, like I said, these trad cons are just the opposite side of the coin of feminism. They actually, they're very anti-male themselves. But they don't, they, just, they only complain when they get zapped. And a lot of these guys, if they had a feminist girlfriend, wouldn't care about Marvel. They'd say, let Marvel burn. And that would include Yellow Flash, I guarantee it. Anyway, thank you, everyone.